All right, Coach, thanks very much. From Lewiston, Idaho with Coach Leach from fall camp. All right, but first uh, we got to, how's your camp going exactly? <laughs> My camp is good. My camp is great. It's um, It's been great to be here, great to meet everybody. And then you're, uh, you're now, you know, a lot of these guys, they played uh, junior high, high school, had decorated careers. Uh, how did how did your career land here? Where did you go to school? Uh, what did you do to develop your skills and uh, and uh, and your talents to the level that uh, will put you in this uh, uh, this lofty position? <laughs> uh, I was uh, I went to Syracuse University, majored in broadcast journalism. Uh, worked in the industry for last ten years in uh, actually in North Carolina. So that's kind of the Concord De La Salle of uh, of universities for broadcasting. Uh, uh, only behind Washington State, right. but that's still good. Yes, exactly. Yeah, the Murrow School is as good as they get. Uh, but no, it was great experience, and um, and everybody's been wonderful here. And then North, how's North Carolina? It's more humid than Lewiston. Um, it's uh, you know it's a great state. Uh, you've got great people, uh, mountains, ocean to the east. Uh, you know, lakes and rivers. Did you go to Mayberry? I, I did, actually, believe it or not. I lived near there. Um, it's actually, so um, Pilot Mountain is is where that's based off of. Yeah, Pilot uh, Point. That's yeah, where you have to yeah. go if you go to buy school clothes. Right. You have to go to Pilot Point. I've uh, been there. Uh, great views. You can see um, where I lived, actually, from that point. If you go to Pilot Mountain, it's a very strange rock formation on the top of the mountain there. It's this weird um, rocky nub on the top of the hill. Was it was it like Andy and Barney? Yeah, it was actually it's stuck in time for sure. Yeah. It's, so it did look like yeah, that? Yeah, it looked oh, yeah. like the set of the oh, show? The well, whole yeah, I mean, you, you know, you, you get the sense when you're got going around there that it really, you could see how and why they came up with the set that they did. It, you know, it's not like they were there. It's not an exact replica type deal, but you know, it's the same spirit, same sentiment. Wow. Well, I didn't pull. I should have pulled off the road. I saw it. And we <laughs> it's went, worth it. Actually, well, we yeah. went to the coast, and then we went and saw where the, where the Wright brothers did their thing. Yeah, yeah. Climbed sand dunes. Uh, yeah. Tried to gauge outer banks. That's all the outer banks. Yeah. So Kitty Hawk. You were Kitty Hawk. Kitty Hawk, yeah. and yeah. tried to gauge the damage of the previous hurricane that they had because they're going to get a couple of year, and then looked at lighthouses. So here's the deal with the way the land is at the in the outer banks. If a hurricane were to come through. The, the sand, especially toward the north, toward the um, toward Virginia, Virginia Beach area, the coast is not rooted like the rest of the uh, like the rest of a typical coastline is. In that it's it's if a, if a real like if Hurricane Sandy came to that area, you know, as it did to New York, it would blow it away completely. The really? sand, yeah, I, th yeah. I thought it would bust it up. It, it, it would if a real big one. You know, I mean, it's got to be a real Hurricane Sandy type deal, but. Um, so, you know, there are the wild horses up near Kerala Beach um, where you, they don't have any roads. You got to drive a, a four wheel Jeep to get out there and you can hang out with the wild horses. It's that land is all like you said, the sand dunes, it's all sandy. I mean, it'll just blow it. It would blow it right away if a really big hurricane came. Through. Well, how do you like the Palouse? What do you think of this? So I, I love the Palouse. Uh, that's the short answer. The long answer is uh, I really love the Palouse. I was from New Jersey growing up, like I said. Uh, went to vacation every summer with my family going camping. I went to Glacier for fun just a few years ago with a, a buddy of mine. Um, the Driving down, I was driving with Gesser down here to practice for the first time yesterday. And when you get down the hill and you see that view of, of Idaho. Oh, yeah, you know, Lewis and Clark, the look, Ness Pierce, the whole thing. It's, they don't have that in New Jersey. I mean, it's breathtaking. It's beautiful. And uh, I love it. I love the land. Um, and uh, people have been great. And... Uh, Obviously, great opportunity. I love the work and love being here. Now, do you hunt and fish? I do fish. I don't hunt. Um, and uh, I fired a gun once at a range yeah. um, in North Carolina. Uh, but uh, fly fishing. Um, oh, they have that here. Yeah, yeah. Um, I want to go. I'd love to go, and not only around here, but also in Montana. And, um, you know, I can't say I'm very good at it, but I like doing it, you know. Well, it's it. we look forward to working with you. It's great to have you. And back to Jason in the studio. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Coach. <laughs>